All right, boys. Yes, I know a lot of people are probably going to hate this card as much as we hate Quadfather and as much as we hate Derrick Henry. We have a new one that is 99 speed. A new X Factor running back that is 99 speed, boys. This is going to be an absolute broken card. But if you guys enjoy gameplays like this, I just posted the Danny Dimes one as well. I do top 10s on the channel. Make sure to hit that like and hit that sub. We are on that road to 30,000 subscribers, boys. But other than that, let's get into the gameplay. Before we start today's video, I wanted to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, Muttpacks.com. You can click the link down below and open exciting packs, win tons of coins, and withdraw your account right away. You could use promo code CHU for 15% off. Lastly, when you sign up, down below you can get a free 10,000 coin pack as well I mean, yeah this is probably gonna be a very fun gameplay it should be at least 99 speed 99 excel and 99 agility that's what the free agency strike card and also the sprinter strike card he is six foot one 238 pounds so he's not as big as Derrick Henry and Quadfather not even close but he's still pretty heavy that's a pretty heavy running back he also has 85 catching which is nuts he has really good carrying 99 change direction 90 I mean on paper like I don't know how a golden ticket gets better than this I truly don't know how this is like literally better than uh, this is like better than Bo knows like golden ticket last year what, what was his name William Perry I feel like this is better than that card but when you look at him right one AP it says offensive downs played I don't know if it's going to be like Derrick Henry's or quad father I threw on persistent just in case we'll obviously be able to tell in game but he also does have bruiser and short and elite for zero pretty good abilities you could use here too but I think this is my favorite combo you could use tank as well but this is what I'm going to rock. I like this combo a lot. We can also pass the ball with him too. And I also forgot to check. What is his route running? He has 88 short route running and 81 medium running. Not bad, boys. This should be a very fun gameplay. Let's get into a game. All right, boys. Here we go. First game with Gus the Bus. I'm excited. I know running the ball this year is not as good unless you use these X-Factors. And I have not used these in forever. Literally forever. The last one I've used was like Saquon and he didn't even have the good X-Factor. It's crazy that Gus the Bus is the best running back in the game. And it's it's like nuts. I don't even have to play with the card, and I already know that. Hey boys, I think I could tell right here, right? Should I be able to tell? What does it say to break it? Offensive downs played, so he has the Derrick Henry one, not the quad father. It's not the best in the world, but it's still very, very good. And you guys can already see we're starting off nicely with an 11-yard rush. I didn't realize as well. Hasn't got, how long has he been in the league? He doesn't have a face scan as well, which kind of does suck. But hey, this guy is a really good team. He has really good edge rushers. He has some guys in the box that are pretty good. Let's see if we have a nice little play right here. Another broken tackle. I mean, he's going to make it very easy. One thing we got to do is keep him honest, though. I've noticed this in a lot of running back gameplays. The more I pass the ball and keep the opponent honest, the easier the game becomes. That's just how, you know, that's just how football works in general. But let's see. We have a nice little play. And look who it is. Wide open, boys. And a stiff arm already. All right. All right, Gus. All right, Gus. He's going crazy, boys. Already going crazy. I did end up flipping this. I think we should be okay. I wish I would have had Gronk on the stronger side, but we do have Casper over there. Maybe we can get some good run blocking right here, boys. And look at him. It's just too easy. It's just too easy with a good running back. I think this is our last play with him, right? Is this our last play? I'm not too sure. I am actually not too sure. I think I passed him. There he is. I, I don't know. This might be the last play with the X Factor. Let's see if we can have a nice little run right here. And look at him, boys. Oh, we got the bad stiff arm animation. He already has 40 yards rushing, 15 yards in the air. We already got a rage quit. Let's get into another one. All right, boys. Game number two. We already got a rage quit under our belt. It looks like I can't. This glitch is super, super annoying. But there's our top three. It would have been awesome if Gus the Bus could make the top three. But I feel like that would make people quit really easy. I don't know. Some people hate playing the X-Factors. But we'll see. Can we get the ball first? Hey, if we can get another big rage quit or a huge run this game, that would be awesome. Oh, no way, right? No way you're running. Look how many people are in the box right now. This is definitely not the most ideal first look. Actually, hold on. Never tackle battle in the first play. All right. Come on, EA. A tackle battle, really? Three, three, five wide ideally is like the best run. Look how many people are in the box. That was obviously a kind of lucky run right here. It's not the most fun to play against, especially in a running back gameplay, but we're going to pass the ball. Keep him a little bit honest. You know what I'm saying? Let's see. And it looks like we're going to have Gus bus wide open. And there we go. Another tackle battle. We ended up... I did not air truck. I guess it made me truck for some reason. It's just it's just tough because I want to run the ball. You know what I mean? I want to run the ball. We got to open it up. You know what? It, we got to open it up. And I have fearless on, by the way. I do have fearless on. Uh, my abilities aren't really working right now. That is now uh, we got in a tackle battle. First play with our X Factor and fearless. There's no way I was out of the pocket. That was like instant. There's no way I was already out of the pocket right there. Maybe I was. Maybe I was. But it looks like we're going to have this open right here. 
And we won another tackle battle, but boys, this is kind of a nasty drive right now so far. I, I know this is probably a dumb play call, but we got to rely on our pack, right? Like, this is like the best running back in the game. Let's rely on him on a fourth and two right here. I probably would never, ever run the ball right now, but we have an X factor. Yeah, it's nice. All right, I'm not too sure what he called right here, but hey, another very, very packed box. Look, everybody is down by the line of scrimmage. And he, we get an, another tackle battle right there. I don't know what's going on. The first game was not like this. I feel like this was happening with Quadfather for a little bit when I was using him. But in the first day with Gus the Boss, come on. Yeah, you got to buff him a little bit. All right, this play was our biggest play of the game, actually. No X Factor, but let's see. We're going to have a nice little run to the left side here. And it looks like we did. Gus the Bus doesn't need the X Factor. He will not go down. He is not going down, boys. This is pretty awesome. It is pretty awesome when you could have a running back this good. I mean, Josh Jacobs has been good for me, but this is definitely very, very nice and look very very good blocking again and our first touchdown of the day comes when we don't have the broken x factor this just show i mean 99 excel 99 agility 99 speed on top of 99 change direction even with the house uh, without the x factor this card is absolutely nuts boys take a seven point lead in this one as well it's so f hey it looks like we're getting i didn't we did we, we didn't play defense last game yeah i almost forgot about it but it looks like we're getting tight to start john madden almost went crazy right there all right, this is definitely different. This is not tight right here, boys. I was not ready for him to come out in something else. Let's see what he's got for us out of here. I, I don't know what to expect out of this play. All right, I think he was looking for that corner out on the left. All right, boys, so he just made it super, super obvious what he's looking for. He's looking for this corner out over here. And I'll guard. Oh, we got clicked off. Not the most ideal. Ryan Neal is a computer just went crazy. He's got for us on fourth and six. I feel like this could be a very nice play for us. We'll see if we can get some pressure and... Uh, all right, Fred Warner, that is my fault. I know. I know I have a linebacker in the field. I know. Don't make fun of me in the chat. I don't know why I still have that card. He has been absolutely terrible for me lately. And yeah, it's just, it just makes it a pain out there. You can't really do much with a card like that. But let's see what he's got for us right here. And all right, he's only throwing that route. So we're okay. We're okay. Boys, he has turned two clock on officially. Okay, he is chewing this out. He is very, very confident right now, boys. We do have a KO right there. You cannot play better defense than that. The game just... This is Madden 23, boys. I just watched that back, and that was the roughest watch of all time. Jesse Bates just watched that man literally walk through. He's probably going to run the trap right here, if I had to guess, right? Yeah, that's just an obvious trap call. And oh, come on, Dalvin. Hey, boys, he is officially running the ball down here. I think we could have a good play. If we could stop him down here, we're in a great spot. All right, boys, what has he got for us? He has been chewing this entire quarter, boys. And look at it, man. Here we go. This is a big play. Literally quick snap everything. That's what makes this entirely way harder of a process. Let's see what he's got for us right here, though, boys. And okay, at least he scored it and didn't go down. Oh, that's so... He just has quick snapped everything. I think Ty is... That's why Ty is so good. Every play by itself is good. It's amazing. Hey right, boys, I know I probably shouldn't run right here, but you never know. You never know what you can do, especially when you have an X factor on your field. Look at it. Oh, we got tackled right there. We'll go out of bounds. That's a good play right there. I'm not going to lie. 70 yards rushing is nice. Well, if you guys do not know what he is running, he's running cover three lock, which is basically just cover three with the slot being usered. So we'll see if we can have a nice little play and look at Gronk, man. That makes the game easier. I really would have had that bomb touchdown. That would have been awesome. But like, hey, we have no more timeouts, so we got to be a little bit more careful here. And it looks like nothing is open. I probably should have not did this, but I think we should still have enough time to spike the ball right here, right? Oh, man. We got like one more play here, boys. All right. If we don't get it, we'll just take ourselves a touchdown. You know what I mean? We'll take the touchdown if we have to, or we'll take the field goal if we have to. Let's see if we can have a nice little play right here. And yeah, we're just going to throw this one away. We'll take our three. All right, boys. We know exactly what he wants to do. I'm going to man that guy up, I think. I think that's the only thing I'm going to do here because he's only shown two plays. That's all he's shown. Hey, boys, we keep on manning that up and let's see what he's got for us right here. He has ran. Uh, yeah, there we go, boys. Hey, we have it all bag now. That's the thing in Madden. You can't just know only three plays. You literally have to know more plays. We know what he's running right here, too. A corner route and a flat route over here. We just need enough little pressure. Let's see. Can we guard the corner? There it is, man. We know you got to have more than like two or three plays. You just have to. Boys, we know exactly what is coming. Can we stop the corner out? Let's see what he's got for us. We just triple teamed it, and he still threw it, boys. That's his only read on that play, and we get ourselves another rage quit. 
I mean, dude, Gus the bus is just, he makes the game too easy. Boys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Gus is a beast. He is an absolute beast in the game. If you guys do not know, I do think the quad father X factor is better, but I do think I would still take Gus the bus. 99 and everything is unfair. It is literally unfair, especially when you don't have the X factor on. He is a much, much better running back. And I think good players will stop quad father unless you're like on a Packers theme team or whatever. I'd probably lean Gus the bus, but let me know how you guys feel about him. He looked really good right there. He had a hundred yards in that second game he had like 50 in the first and a rage quit already definitely a good game boys i hope to see you guys in the next video though come check us out on stream we stream every single day at 1 p.m eastern see you guys later peace out boys